More than a thousand people returning from China and nearly 500 others with close contact with infected patients are being quarantined and monitored and waiting for test results. With the latest achievements, Vietnam is able to test thousands of samples a day when necessary. This will also be a prerequisite for developing a vaccine against the virus in the future. At present, the country still has enough materials for 2019 and COVID tests. This demonstrates that Vietnam has very strong infection disease laboratory system. Isolation and sharing of the new virus, like this virus, is very important because it enables researchers to design, validate, and then standardize test method. It also helps to establish external quality assessment program that monitor laboratory performance. Vietnam reported two more 2019 and COVID cases on February 6, bringing the total number of infected patients in the country to 12. Vietnam is actively taking measures to prevent the spread of the deadly virus, which has killed more than 630 people and infected more than 31,480. The WHO acknowledges that Vietnam has so far been managing this outbreak very well. The country has activated its response system at very early stage of the uh, outbreak. Uh, this includes enhanced surveillance system, early case detection of the cases, isolation of cases, case management, and then in, in, enhanced uh, infection prevention control system in, in the hospital. As part of measures to control the virus, on February 7, the Vietnam Red Cross Society organized a campaign to raise public awareness of coronavirus prevention.